and welcome to my channel. Yeah, I'm coming and I make sure that it's left. Welcome to my channel. Thank you for the love, the support, the subscription. You know what I got? I got two things before I even start my channel. I got Sim City. S-I-M City. And I also got Spirit Cooking. So whatever you pick up on that, that's what it is. Sim City, you know that game, but applying it to reality. Sim City. And spirit cooking. That's what they some of them do. You know, they you know they're cooking and using you conquer up um entities and spell the cast out to the collector or whoever they want them out. But I said those two things. Um that's what that's what I picked up. Let me get right into the reading, all right? Let me get five card spirit answers of the highest value. Hold up, what's this? April 15. I think it's at 11.55 or 11.55. April 15. Okay. Ten of Pentacles. This is dealing with uh, the inheritance, money, stability, family, um, structure security or you could be a bread winner this is also dealing with an unexpected income so maybe you could be dealing with some unexpected income or somebody thought they were going to be receiving an unexpected inheritance or money or lump sum um so they could be able to provide provide for their family you do have the um the nine of cups in reverse. So this is telling me that the dream that they thought was shattered is not working. It's not happening. Okay, they, they have a nightmare. They're unhappy. This um represent devastation. So the nine of um, cups to me is it could be bisexual um energy going on. Also, they're not happy. They're not pleased. So whatever they expected, it wasn't. It didn't come through. This is not a wish fulfillment. Unsatisfied. Un unpleased. Okay, we do have the King of Cups. That's who, all right? This person could be dealing with some kind of wealth or has some knowledge of wealth. Or this is the person that um, is unsatisfied. Whatever it was hoping for, whatever it was dreaming of, collective, is shattered. It's just it's unfulfilled. Okay, so we're going to keep moving on. He's trying to keep his emotion um, stabilized and not... And, um, allowing you to see how he really feel, feel, but the person is broken from the inside out. He's not, you know, he's not. He's trying to hold that feeling inside. We have the page of cups here. This is telling me this was about a love. This was comfort. All right. This is kindness. Okay. This is usually intuition. I feel like this person could be looking for some kind of comfort or looking for some kind of um, love now. Okay. Now, because it's all broken, it's hiding its feelings and stuff like that. This person was very dreamy. All right. We have a fish team. A fish represent dreamy. All right. Um, this is dealing with emotions. Another page of cups. Yeah. But it seemed like, you know, it's holding the, the their emotions in, not allowing people to see how they actually truly feel, but they 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 tearing up inside, believe me. All right. They might not show it. This is someone interested in learning about emotional issues or whatever it is. No, that person who uses intuition should listen to his intuition and we're within. Okay, we do have the six of cups here. We go again with the six of cups. This is somebody from the somebody past or childhood, or it could be a father or a child here, right? This is somebody from some being influenced, but this is someone who is missing somebody from somebody's past, or they whip back. All right, this was some immature ass shit. Okay, a lot of sharing, a lot of gifting, a lot of family, a lot of support. So this person is going to have to need their family for support, the uplifting all over again. Because obviously this man is holding his emotions and he had a high farm. Not really telling you what it is, okay? It's not. Let's grab some um hoodoo. All right. So we have the um 
the two of sticks. Yeah, planning. Make it plans, okay? This is definitely someone who's looking outwards, making strategizing, they're making plans, or collective, you could be making plans, strategizing, or something. But yeah, this person is, is getting a new perspective on things, looking out to the world and getting a new perspective because somebody's dreams have been shattered because they really thought universe said hell to the no. We told you. Spirit ancestors said, we told you. You went behind our back and the collective back and did some bullshit. We had the father sticks in reverse. A party. Father. The father. Let me get, um, okay. The seven of coins. This is um, investing, growing, investing, right? And the, the grandchildren. So you're going to pour that into the... So basically, they want to skip you collective and sisters who's a karmic father to invest and put it in the children. So skip you and put it in the children. Or skip you and go to a karmic and put it in the, in the children. You see what I'm saying? Collective? That's what it was nurturing and, and, and um, um, protecting the grand five states competition too many people too many competition right and miss ida miss ida is like a pageant you know beauty pageant and back in those days right this is someone who's held in in in, in the in, in um a platform but this is represent like beauty pageant beautiful and and admiring and, and that's what this is so yeah the daughter of nine is in reverse, so that's a karmic. Let's get some more of this that we have six minutes and fifty four seconds. I don't want to take an hour for some seven, six minute video like it did yesterday. That's why my video became short, not long. Peace, okay? Peace came out. You you are focusing on peace, prosperity, and abundance. You want peace within it as well as your surroundings. So that's what you're focusing on, all right? Let's get some more couple of cards out. I'm going to upload this, all right? You do have the ten swords on top of the deck. So there's a lot of swords around you. Spirit, give me another card. Milk and honey, that's you, collective. All right, mending somebody want to mend. I don't think it's pure. And then why? Know your whys. Or if you don't know the questions or whatever it is, make sure you get um, some spiritual um, knowledge, do some research, uh, find out the answers. If you're not and use your intuition, then you might have to do some online research or library or whatever it is. So whatever the question is, if you don't know your why, you cannot move forward. You got to know why to be able to be like, okay, this is what it is. And I can stand on it and be able to move forward. It's okay not to know. Don't worry about this on the side. I'm protecting my skin. You better be glad I had the whole face mask on. You have a deeper knowing. That's why. <laughs> That's why you have a deeper knowing. You're out. You're bouncing. Your intuition's on point with the moon, okay? Or what kind of planet this is. Whatever. But anyway, you have the owl, which is knowledge, okay? So you have a deeper knowing. And you're going after yours. Six hours. Six hours is, is timing, all right? The timing. The timing is now for you collected to be able to push forward, all right? You are that milk and honey. The karmic father can't take it. The karmic can't take it and put it in grandchildren or the karmic grand. There's, nobody can take nothing from you. What's, what's destined for you is destined for you, period. And this is the journey that we're going to go on. I'm going to keep pulling out some cards. I'm going to keep doing the tarot. I'm going to keep being spiritual. I'm going to keep doing what I'm doing regardless of what anybody fucking said because they tried to change this shit up and they did that last year. So collective, I'm going to come back with another one. Keep doing you. Keep being inspiring. Keep going to work. Put a smile on your face and even they see the gums and shit. Do you. Alright, I'm gonna come back with another reading, alright? Stay safe.